So if we can print it, print it. Um, if you can get it printed in color, that would be super awesome so that I could see your different colors in your chart. I also want you to email this to me. So we're going to go to file. We are going to save it as we are going to put our period first. And I said I was in period six. So we're going to put six, my name. If you want to space it, you can. You don't have to space it here. And look at the format. I'm going to talk about the format really quick. The format here is either .docx or .doc. If you're in the newer versions of Microsoft Office or Microsoft Word, you're going to have this little X at the end because that's the newer version of these of these files. Now, if I want this to be accessible to all versions of Microsoft Word, I would hit this .doc because sometimes you'll have teachers or you'll have people who don't have the newest version of stuff and that's okay. So if you want to make it a .doc, that's fine. .docx should be fine when you're turning it in for my class. Class, but just keep it in mind if you have teachers that have older versions of Microsoft Word or Office in their in their classrooms you want to always make sure that you have this .doc in my case it doesn't matter so we're gonna save it somewhere that we know we're gonna be having access to it and I hit save so you should be able to see it over here there it is Perfect. Now we're going to email it to me and if you um, have access to a color printer, go ahead and print it out so that you know that it's all turned in.